like he was having fun. Was it was it not fun? I don't know. Well, depends you were here. You was depends it fun? On, <laughs> depends on who you ask. I'm asking you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was it was interesting. <laughs> All right. Well, back. Bring out those vampire slayers. We got the Belmont, and of course S2H with his new tag of passion. What does that mean? You and uh, you, you and S2H are pretty close, right? No. Pretty close enough, right? Not really. Oh, okay. <laughs> do, you, do you want me to get a dictionary? Passion? No, I don't need the de I don't need the definition of passion. You asked what I want to know why. I want to know why S2H is wearing passion. I don't know. You'd uh, have to ask him. Maybe uh, maybe if he wins the tournament, we can give him an interview. Ask him about that. But uh, you know, Dome Lock in the take this tag very, no. very fitting for Belmont. Yeah, it's almost like he knows what his character says. But ooh, take this, take that axe to the face. And he's looking to hand out more than just these holy bars. He's looking to hand out an L to SQH tonight. Oh, that was very smooth. He caught the the holy water off the bounce of um, SQH's shield, and then Z dropped it. Yeah, it's still not. You know, enough to find the sock, but he's been very commanding over S2H right now. 132% to 13. Mm -hmm. And just another F tilt's gonna keep S2H in the air and off stage. What, are these, what is the, the traps gonna be? F tilts and back airs. And one connects. Yes. Is that a taunt? I think I saw a taunt. Was it? Yeah, that was a taunt. Damn. The stream master said it was a taunt. Damn, I. T3 Dome kind of feeling himself. Forward throw into the forward, and this is a very bad spot for Victor, but great recovery from Dome. Oh, Don't rolling roll in. into that Don't F smash. Why not? Because you get hit with forward smash. Oh, like all the time? I mean, if SH is charging a forward smash, though, yeah. Oh, okay. All right, holy water. There we go. More holy water. Ooh. F tilt. Connecting more F tilt. Uh, you catch it again? No, he didn't. It okay. Stopped. I, oh wow! He saved him. I, yeah, he no, he <laughs> actually saved the jump. I think he was alive. Back air out of shield is going to be enough to close out that sock. And SH making a good run here, closing the gap between the two of them. Okay, back air, but I mean, we can still has a wall of projectiles to get through. And SH slowly going to be chipped away as Dome continues to just uh, land hit after hit. Yeah, once again, you know, it's reminiscent of the first stock where it starts off pretty solid for both of them. Oh, that was an F smash. Dome just starts running away with it, with uh, missing out on his confirm right there for the stock. And now S2H gets a turn to play the game. Forward throw into the forward air. Spends a second jumping up. He's a little early, trying to recover high. High bite lands on the ground. He's back now. S2H looking for a panic air dodge into the ledge, but just all over Dome right now. Oh, down air. Very, very aggressive landing from Dome. I like the way he used the, the Holy Water to cover his landing, though. That, that, was, that was very nice. Oh, oh where's the, the F water. smashes? I don't think he actually expected that Holy Water to connect. Was looking to try and punish a jump. But s getting hit what by it, and Dome just wasn't ready. Okay, more F tilts on s shield and using a dimensional cape. Not going to take the stock. But I think he did have to expend his air dodge just to keep himself alive. He did, and that dimensional cape is so good for S2H right now. We've seen it connect twice. Finally able to get the stock with it. Now S2H holding a lead over Dome. Mm -hmm. More air tilts, and then um, Dome's just really trying to look way how he's going to close out this second stock. We see. Okay, yeah. Getting the conversion off the holy water. He's had a couple opportunities to take stocks with that holy water. He just has yet to really uh, convert. But making it convert when he counts. Oh, and there he is again where he catches the Holy Water bouncing off the shield. He knows you're gonna be sure at the first time. Can you do it a second time though? Okay, down air connects and rolling in very smart as uh, S2H is playing very aggressive, trying to land a dash attack to convert. Yeah, and we're kind of seeing Dome fight S2H head to head a lot more on this stop. We're just throwing out these aerials, try to stop S2H from approaching instead you know, controlling the stage with his projectiles. And more F tilts connecting onto S2H. As you can see, that damage just continues to rise, but a dimensional cape will land. And ooh, dash attack almost landing. Ooh, careful S2H getting the dimensional cape in with the swing as well. Going to take a percent lead over T3 Dome. But there's the down area to the up and that's going to do it. 
Wow, saving it for the very last moment of game one. Dome clutching out game one with the dive kick. All right. Yeah, I mean, great stuff there from Dome. Able to, you know, clutch out when the pressure was on, especially when you start with a lead like that and they start making a comeback. You can get a little shaky. Stays hard to keep your composure, but Dome making it work, taking a moment to actually recompose himself. That man's deep in thought right now. Why is, why is Dome taking a moment to compose himself? He won. Yeah, but I mean, it was close. That's which was making the comeback. Oh, okay. Yeah, but he won. It can still be stressed for a win. <laughs> okay, Especially, well, you know, when you're the lowest seed, you, you know, you get that. Is Dome the lowest seed? I said lower. Oh, lowers? <laughs> lower? Okay. But yeah, it can get in your head a little bit when you start, you know, getting the game one off the PR player. Oh, well. Oh, I thought wow. I was just I'm surprised he actually made that back. <laughs> what the heck? Dang. Yeah, and right now, Dome just. Staying up the space, don't get off the ledge. Oh, but not being able to be reversed that holy water is going to be detrimental. Didn't cost him too much at the moment, but hopefully he's not. He doesn't make a vital mistake like that again. But a couple of up airs into a back air. Ooh. Ooh, I love the use of tornado right there. Keep a lasting hitbox out, but great tether recovery from Dome swinging right under it. I like the approach with the forward airs. Wasn't able to convert, but he. Does have the the conversion on the deck, I'm sure. Ooh. That was a very interesting interaction right there between the holy water coming out after the last hit of the back there. Okay, down air is right in front of S2H again. I wonder if S2H is starting to notice when uh when Dome is feeling like down airing. Yeah, but great setup right there from Dome. Back here, going to, oh, not going to do it, actually. My mistake, I really thought S2H was gone. Axe not going to do it either. That's right, he's getting hit by a flurry of projectiles, but that Axe is going to do it. Uh, throw the entire armory at him. Yeah, we're just seeing it over and over between the Axe and the Cross Toss and the Holy Water, but a B for S2H is going to be able to claim that first stock off of t 3 Dome. Right. And now we're seeing more forward airs and back airs connect onto S2H. Having a little bit of trouble. He's approaching high. So really when he's approaching high, you really just need to be afraid of the the axe that can really only take that, yeah. that approach. And we're seeing Dome often just go for an instant recovery. Doesn't want to stall himself out there and let S2H find footing to edge guard it. Oh, sending Dome right back to stage with, with the help of Tornado. Landing in front of Dome. Landing a forward air. Now S28 is on the approach once again. I am. Dome saying, I have the lead. I have no reason to approach you. You have to break through my projectiles right now. I feel I, like Dome would be sticking to the game plan even if he was behind. He would yeah. just like slowly approach and retake stage control. I mean, that's what we saw right there when S28 finally got a bit of a percent lead. The game plan didn't really change. Did he just tell him? Oh, I missed it if he did. I saw jabs. Jabs are cool. Oh, and he gets a single tick of the Holy Water, catches S2H, not ready for it, gets the forward smash. Yeah, completely expecting the, or ready for the conversion this time. Oh, Holy Water, try to push him into the Holy Water. <laughs> Just uses his body. Uh, okay, that was an interesting show, or not show, drill last. Oh, and we see another dimensional cape coming in clutch for S2H. He's gotten a lot of mileage from that down B. Alright, now this is all on Dome right now. It's his game to lose, but S2H gets the down throw, runs off with the up air, but actually gets a little backwards hit, so we can't force Dome off stage. That's right, and as you can see, Dome continuing to play the keep away game. He continues to run away and just keep S2H at within a distance for where uh, he's not exactly landing the F tilt, but they are definitely a threat. Yeah, exactly. And, you know, even if he's not hitting, he's still zoning, which is what Victor wants to be doing. Oh, the Holy Fire in hand. He's able to use it and converts. Oh, and these hits just not sending the way S2H wants them to. Oh, that instant tether just 
really that's just weaved around. It. That's the 2-0 for TP Dome. No fist bump? No fist bump. That switch is not happy. Well, good job to Dome. Yeah. 2-0-ing S2H. He doesn't need a fist bump. He's in one of the semis. You know, that's I don't right. Think he's a I don't think he's too hurt by that. No fist bumps required. All right, do all the Belmonts know each other? Because they just kind of, like, congregated <laughs> and, well, it looks like, like, celebrated. It looks like we have another.